Hello, this is Lego Maestro back again after a quite the unofficial hiatus. It is now the new year 2017 and I was off the wagon completely after a quite the legendary case of artist block. Not only did I stop recording videos, I stopped drawing and sketching at home, which is something that always comes and goes for the same usual reasons. No, what is the point? I am not progressing in any way. In the yada yada yada, the usual crisis and despair at not being as good as I wish I was. So here I am again and attempting with much zeal and gusto. Okay, not with so much, but um, <coughs> I am interested in continuing this thing because, as I have already mentioned in the much earlier videos, I I am interested in in seeing how people do this sort of thing and for my own personal progress i think it's pretty nice to see how i go through drawings maybe for future references and the best thing that could ever happen was would be to a to be able to see some notable improvement and to top it off i can share some of my insights and thoughts and just yeah generally blabber around until the video comes to an end so here I am using MS Paint. At first I was actually using MS Paint and mouse because I am a masochist like that. Yeah, I saw some amazing videos on YouTube. People who were making some great anime, anime art with M with MS Paint and mouse, and the patience and and awesomeness to do that. I've even seen an animation done by some guy. Uh, not some guy. This guy is pretty f famous in the circle. C T Chrysler. He actually did test animations with with his um, with a mouse on GIMP and yeah more than anything it just proves that there's really no excuse to the quality of a drawing when it comes to the software I use and I like streamlining everything as much as possible which is why I'm still drawing with pen and ink when it comes to traditional art I still think that I don't I don't quite yet require the extra tools like erasure and and fancy tools that Photoshop can give you. Not yet anyway. It's not it's not what I'm focusing on. I just I want to be able to put my ideas on paper. And more than anything I want I want to be reliable enough to be drawing so regularly that it becomes second nature to me. None of these random artist blocks because if I can't draw reliably then there's no point in trying to search out some great wonder software that will solve my drawing problems or <laughs> or promise that I'll suddenly go into a study of the the human form which I've done once or twice which are very informative and help and I hope to be able to do that but for now I want to be I want the mileage and I want to do this thing reliably and regularly without any questions I just draw this time around I was um watching a House of Cards episode when I was doing this sketch on a massive canvas. I just, I, uh, music is usually the go-to thing, but sometimes that gives me too much brain space and my inner editor kills me. So watching a TV series solves that because it really takes, takes up a huge part of my concentration, which helps me just shut off, ironically. Um, there's also a great instrumental band that I listen to, Kokomo. That was pretty good. That got me into the zone for some earlier drawings. I think I'll just I'll go ahead and show them at the end of this video. So while I was doing that, I also... What's interesting about watching a TV series when you're doing these sorts of drawings is that you can also do spot references for how certain things look for faces. <laughs> and you notice more than ever when you see in media that uh, there's a lot more older people than you would expect. Not everyone is a... <laughs> shonen protagonist with wavy hair you know so it's good to remember that people come in all ages and all sizes and all shapes but i do love the cartoony style i do love characteristic shapes like these twins that i was drawing i wish i had i wish i could have done this in real time and just recorded all my thoughts but that would be yes <laughs> 45 minutes and <laughs> yeah ridiculous so yeah i <coughs> Here I was trying to do something without much rendering. 
it's it's quite shocking how how good it feels to draw with a tablet on MS Paint after after struggling along with a mouse for so long. <laughs> I think the m when I'm drawing with a mouse, I should definitely only do use the curve tools and line tools as as the other videos do. Otherwise, it's it's quite horrible to to make nice strokes. It just doesn't work at all. <laughs> so this is more of just a prep video or just you know start of the year it's already february how fast the month goes i i hope to finally get onto that comic video that i was promising and i've been playing titan 4 lately so i do want to upload some of my more embarrassing moments where i get pawned like a noob <laughs> that should be interesting yeah on the road of learning so I'll catch you in the next video. Thank you for any attention rendered. I'll see you next time. This was Lego Maestro. Peace.